Mysteries, new characters, new thrills. NBC's action-packed drama Manifest is finally back with all new episodes tonight. No one is more excited than our Crystal Henderson. She got to chat with two of the show's actors to give us a glimpse into season three. And action. Hey, I'm Josh Dallas. Hi, I'm Athena Karkanis from Manifest. Grace, I didn't choose who's in the lifeboat. Hi, Crystal. Hi, Crystal. Greetings from the Grand Canyon State. My stepbrother lives in Phoenix. Hey, Randy. Hey, Randy. <laughs> I've been there many, many times, and I love it. It's so beautiful. I am so excited to talk to you because I am a proud manifester. Manifest is my favorite show. I'm so excited yes. to get back to it. So what's in the works for this third season? There's a lot of answers that we get this season. There are some more questions. What is this tail fin? Why did it come out of the ocean? We all saw that plane explode on the tarmac in New York City. What does that mean for the plane? What does that mean for the passengers? Are they, in fact, the passengers, or are they something else entirely? Do you guys ever make bets along the way on what you think is going on? No, because we would lose every time. Yeah, we'd be out a lot of money. <laughs> You'd be broke. <laughs> I'm right there with you. How did you guys pull off filming this season in New York amid a pandemic and a wild winter of record snowfall and even blizzards? It was quite a feat. We were really strict with all the protocols. Filmmakers are a group of people that are so adaptable and we adapted and we pivoted and we moved and we got it done. Now it, it's going to feel weird if we go back to filming in a normal kind of way. And here we are filming our last week. When you read the finale of this season, what was your immediate impression? It's very shocking. I was speechless for about an hour after I read the finale episode. The overall theme is everything is connected. Do you think everything is connected in real life? Yes. I do. This past year, more than anything with the pandemic, we've really learned how our actions and how our communities are all connected in terrible ways, as in, you know, the virus spreading and people getting sick, but also in these beautiful ways where you saw people and communities coming together and reaching out to help more vulnerable people. And I think that's a big theme of season three. It's, you know, it's not about our individual actions, but in order for us all to survive, it's all about what we do as a group. Well, I hope that we can connect soon in the future, and I can't wait to check out the new episodes of Manifest. Bye. Take care. Bye, Randy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't miss Manifest. It's tonight at 7, and it's only on 12 News.